today is the day I've decided to start bringing down some of the autumn and Hallow's Eve decor. Throughout the past couple of days, I've just been rummaging through the holiday decor. I've started decluttering a box that went missing. I found it this year, so I got a chance to find a lot of awesome garland and wreaths. I'm super excited to get started with decorating for Christmas. It feels only right to clear the space and make it clean, tidy, and cozy before I start bringing in more decor. <laughs> so I'm going to do some dusting, vacuuming. I will start off by collecting all of the textiles that I used, pillows, towels, blankets, and then putting that into the washing machine. But then we will actually start taking all of the decor away and finding a new home for everything. Of course, the first thing that should probably go down are all of these bats. And also replacing all the black candles. I'd like to collect all of the pumpkins and maybe put them all on the table as a tablescape. bit of a cottage hack to share. <laughs> I love to make simmer pots during the autumn and the winter. It's my way of bringing the outdoors indoors. So I utilize this really simple recipe of citrus slices, apple slices, cinnamon sticks, and a whole handful of cloves. I simmer this water all day long, 
literally the water ends up evaporating to a certain point and I have to turn it off. <laughs> Nonetheless, it builds this aroma of coziness and organic just delicious goodness i don't even know how to explain it you would love this recipe try it out for the holidays it's something really easy and fun to do and really puts a little moody spin on the life <laughs> Wow, it feels so refreshing in the cottage now to have everything off to a clean state. What? <laughs> it honestly just feels really nice to have everything cleared off. It gives my mind more creativity to figure out how I want to decorate the cottage for Christmas. I am feeling fresh. I'm feeling free. And I think that's one of the biggest reasons why I love to undecorate. <laughs> it's nice to just start off with a clean slate and dust everything down, vacuum everything up, do a little bit of shining and adjust some pillows, fluff them up a bit. Now I can just bask in the ambiance of vision, creativity, and ideas. So then when I'm ready to just start decorating, I can splat on the canvas without having to worry about any other decor that might possibly be in its place. So I'm so happy. I have indeed been decluttering my Christmas decor. Essentially, I've been trying to get rid of things that I probably won't use this year or I haven't used in previous years. The declutter went very well the past few days. So now it's just more about me enjoying the ambiance of the season 
and awaiting Thanksgiving. <laughs> I do have some pumpkin pillows that I'm laying out on the little bench over here on the wall. And I just think that the colors are so beautiful and can blend into the Christmas season too. I also want to keep this pumpkin garland on the curio cabinet where I keep my herbs. I just love it so much. Until I make my Christmas tree garland, I'm going to leave that one up. Thanksgiving is still on its way, so I didn't want to completely obliterate all of the autumn decor. So I have my pumpkins just kind of splown all over the table. I still have my apple cinnamon candle going. I'm still rocking the fireside vanilla tea. However, I am using a more seasonally appropriate mug. Ghosty is being put away until further notice. <laughs> now it's just time to figure out some fun ideas and prepare for the holiday season. November is an interesting month. I love November. I think it's a beautiful time and it's the calm before the storm, essentially. Vlogmas is coming up. I am totally doing that again this year. For Thanksgiving, I won't be hosting. The last gathering I had would be the last one until probably December. This month, I get to just chill and enjoy the cottage. Get her prepped up to become a Christmas Emporium. I feel like it fluctuates for me every year. Some years I wanna do it November 1st. <laughs> well, the first or second week of November. Other times I do it on Thanksgiving, around Thanksgiving. Um, and then there's been a year or two where I waited literally till the first week of December and I don't like waiting until December personally. I enjoy having decorations up for at least two months when it comes to Halloween and Christmas. So this year I will be starting a little bit earlier. We'll see. It's fun and hopefully this was a little bit of a motivation for you and perhaps we could get this holiday season started together. I'm excited. I love the spirit of the holidays. So cheers to that. And uh, until next time. <laughs>